semifinals of the GLVC tournament, top seed and host Drury against five seed Missouri St. Louis. In case you didn't know, Drury landing a five piece of all GLVC awards this season. Peyton Richards named to the third team, Emily Parker second, Isaiah Lynch and Paige Robinson first team, and one more for Robinson named the GLVC player of the year. Drury and Umzel with similar stats in many categories. Umzel the better rebounding team, but Drury the much higher powered offense. Early on, back and forth, DU down one. Robinson changes that, absorbs the contact, and gets it to fall. Both teams feeling each other out early. This is Katie Kirkhart, too strong on the drive. Kirkhart in foul trouble early, though, picks up two quick ones. Lady Panthers up 10 to 7. Umzel's strategy, very simple. Create offense through their bigs. Alex Laporta, the first teamer, had seven of the Tritons' 11 first quarter points. Here's two of them. Drury up just to 13 to 11 after the first quarter. Lady Panthers making the adjustments. Umzel goes inside. This time it's Kiara Stewart. Isaiah Lynch says, I don't think so. Lynch gumming up the paint. Very next possession. Richards on the steal. Drury first in the GLVC in that category at over 13 a game. Defense leads to offense as Richards finishes on the other end. DU on a 9-0 run up 20 to 11. Emily Parker's turn. This is what she does. Drives, spins the jumper. Is pure. She pushes the lead to 11, 28 to 17. Parker not done. She rips off her own 6-0 scoring spurt. The senior so versatile, making the Umzel bigs uncomfortable as she draws them outside the paint. She finished with 12. Cue the GLVC player of the year. The best ISO player in the league. She smells blood. You can hear the Umzel bench yelling, she wants the shot! She wants the shot! Yes, she does. And the Tritons, with very little resistance. Halftime clock ticking down now. Drury swarms. Richards swipes it and finishes on the other end. A 10-0 run to end the half. Suddenly puts the Lady Panthers up 17, 38-21. A 25-10 second quarter for Drury. We jump to the fourth. Umzel has it down to 10. Kirkhart with a big bucket to start the quarter that halts the Tritons momentum back to a 12 point game. Under 7 to play lead still at 12. This is Drury center on the break. Isaiah Lynch they call her queen. Back to Kirkhart a huge drive from the senior here aggressive to the rim and one her teammates fired up as Kirkhart pushes the lead back to 17 and you could feel the Tritons confidence deflate a little bit there. Allie Clevenger coming off a big quarterfinal game sinks the 3 here. She had 11 off the bench. It's 70 to 56 Drury. Umzel had chances. This basket from Isaiah Lynch, really a metaphor for the Tritons in this game. It just slipped through their fingers. Robinson leads Drury with 18, Lynch 15, Lady Panthers execute their game plan and down Umzel 75 to 62 and they are heading to the GLVC championship game as they look for the unprecedented five-peat. We knew if we were going to um, take a big lead that rebounding was our number one key factor. Um, Laporta is a really good rebounder. I think she leads conference or top in the conference so we knew we had to keep her off the boards. Going for the five, Pete. Um, you know, I'm excited for our kids. They um, they have put themselves in this position because of buying in and, and working so hard every single day. So I'm really excited for them. But uh, we're not done yet. I mean, we're going for the five, Pete. 